Here's a turbo wheel lightning, also known as the Zero 10X and other names. I've put steering dampener, which I do recommend. Helps a lot. Also upgraded the, I guess you call it coupling or whatever you want to call it here, but this is a lot better than the stock one. It's a lot solid, a lot more solid, and it holds the stem pretty well. I wrapped mine in carbon fiber. I don't know if you can see it. Here I have the lights mounted. The top, my phone holder. These lights, I recommend, they are super bright. Very, very bright. You have a, re a little switch button. You could turn them on and off. As you can see, remote. You put them on the steering wheel. It has three adjustments, high beam being, you know, number one, medium, and low. But they are super bright. They illuminate everything on the road. These guys, I put, these are regular bicycle lights. They can either go red or white. You can set the flashing different uh, settings. There's a second one, third one. I like the strobe. Oh, there's a strobe. One, two, three, four. That way you're very visible at night, especially with the lights on. Okay. I put hydraulics in the front and the back. You see, I got a camera also mounted in the back and in the front. And what's really cool about this camera is that you can control these cameras simultaneously with one remote. I also have it plugged into the power, the USB from the scooter. So when you turn it on, it'll turn on the camera. And it runs off the battery, the scooter. And when you're ready to record something or take a picture, that's a picture. And both cameras will take the picture at the same time or record at the same time. The one in the back will do the same thing. Cool little feature. Turn it off. Okay. That's it. Mirror, side view mirror, definitely recommend if you're especially riding with somebody or to see the car is coming from behind. Oh, another thing I failed to mention, the battery for these two lights are running off a LiPo that I have in here. You could put three volt, four volt, uh, not three volt, uh, three cell, four cell. Depends, you could use a bigger battery if you want. I have another bigger one here. If I'm going for a super long ride and I'm using both lights, this will last hours. But more than enough, this little one is enough for a nice, you know, two, three hour ride. You got enough for both lights. And you can recharge it up and that's it. Because <clears throat> the lights, the battery comes with, sucks. So I just made my own set up right there. Okay. And the camera shuts off too when you shut off the scooter, which is cool. Uh, what else? But yep. This is the switch for the headlights. Right here, turn them on and off with this one. And uh, that's about it. I'll have a uh, Zero X11 coming soon, which I ordered. I'm just waiting for it to arrive. I also have a uh, Zero 10 there, and I believe that's a Zero 8 but it's called a turbo pacer from the place I bought it out of California, uh, E-Wheels. Very nice guy, Jason. This is where I got it from. 
that one as well. And I got this one from Jason from E Wheels. So great scooter, love it. Recommend it. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.